Those who moved to Miles for peace and quiet have had some adjusting to do in the past six months, with new faces moving to town each and every day. They're accommodating for a very energetic energy sector. Four years ago, I would have known 95% of the population. Today, I probably <laughs> know about a quarter. A huge amount of traffic through the town these days. Just getting used to people from all over the world, all the different nationalities around at the moment. Unemployment's never been this low in miles. It's under 2%. The town certainly benefited from the, the gas industry. The businesses that are doing well are anybody with accommodation, earthworks, plumbing, anybody with the trades, food. Property values are rising exponentially as the population grows. There are around 1,300 people here now, but they're in for some company. I spoke with John Kingston of Hub Realty to talk about his experience and what's to come. So recent stats have property investment here with about a return of 10%. What was the case five years ago in Miles? Five years ago, you'd buy a block of land in Miles for $75,000. You'd rent it out for $400 a week. You can see what's happened in the meantime. Full bedroom house in Miles is pulling about $1,100 a week. If it's furnished, you'll pull a little bit more of a premium. And to think where we are, three, four hundred kilometres away from the beach and from Brisbane, out in the bush, so to speak, to prices that you pay more for in the bush. Like, you know, you find a place where you're paying $1,100 a week in Brisbane or getting returns of over 10% somewhere like Brisbane on the coast. You can't see it. Once a place has been built, how long does it take to rent? Lock the door, clean it up, it's rented straight away. Units, houses, whatever. We just can't get enough of it. We've got a zero vacancy rate in miles at the moment. There's that much demand that people are climbing over each other to get to them. It's going to be years before we get the supply up to where we need to find equilibrium for rentals. Huge strain on accommodation is, is probably the most noticeable. 